All right, YouTuber. All right, we are back today. Hopefully, this shit works. Um, it ain't been tripping for the last couple of times I've been dueling, so hopefully, this shit uh, gets to going. And this is a pretty decent hand. Um, it looks like this man has a Max C on him, but uh, I don't know why I would do that to him. So hopefully, um, we get um, we get some good duels in pretty much. We're gonna just drop this here top and it's oh, we're playing Paleozoics. Oh, we're playing Paleozoic, and he's playing Max C. I don't get it. Twin Twister. Bam. Nope. <clears throat> All right. So I'm just going to already off the top special something this. Bam. All right. Let's see what he does. I'm pretty sure he's going to activate that Max C. Is he or is he not? Because I'm going to drop the top and Tom Borg or not. Um, Max C. Max C me. Max C me. Max C me. Please, Big Apple. There you go. That's all I wanted you to do, bro. That's all I wanted you to do. Now I'm just going to pot of desires. And I'm gonna just going to wait. Um, that, was even, that, was, that was even better. Um, now, um, I'm not. I'm pretty sure he does. He's, oh, hold on. Let's see what I banished. Ooh, Bone Crusher. That's bad. I'm going to need that. Both Teratops? Yep, both Teratops. Okay. One Twin Twister. That's bad. Oh, fuck. A, a solitaire, a unizombie, and a two solitaire. So we only have one left. Um, <clears throat> that's not really a problem. Let's just get these attack over. So he's already going neck one. We're already good. We're already good. Internet ain't dropping till we, we, we're all, we are. We're, we're doing pretty good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set three. I'm going to set three because um, give it out a good old shuffle. Set that one. Set that one. And then set this too. I'm gonna set three and tell him to go. Don't want to give him any extra cards. It looks like he's playing Paleozoic. So, um, if anything on the con contrary happens, you start activating these cards, then shit like Swallow Slash is gonna be used. Um, yeah, I don't care about that. I don't care about Reckless. Reckless is not a problem. You don't have any Paleozoics in your graveyard. Um, it's not really bothering me. Um, I might just banish Solitaire. I might just banish Solitaire just for the fact that I do have a Levy Air play. Um, uh, that might be the better choice. And I also have the Swallow Slash that, um, that I can do. All right, so uh, this is a newly set. So let's go ahead and in phase. All right, so what we want to do is definitely, uh, th this is the hard part. So um, I don't uh, I don't really care about the newly set. Uh, I really wish we didn't have Bone Crusher banished. Um, we're gonna just hit these two, I believe so. Yeah, we're gonna hit these two. I'm mad that Bone Crusher is banished. Um, I probably actually should have hit the new set because it might've been a reckless greed. Um, and then like he would pretty much be behind two turns. He's already he's already very behind because he um, he reckless greed And if he doesn't have something else to draw with he's gonna be pretty much in okay I don't I don't yeah, all right. So that uh, we already did good by hitting uh, Wabaku. Oh Yeah, well, all oh, oh, this is just beautiful. This is just beautiful and it's during the end phase So oh, all this shit this nothing even resolves and this is <clears throat> this is my biggest thing about the Paleozoic deck It's just not that good. Now I could no so, yeah, solitaire is just twenty times better. It is a million times better to do. Oh, that's even good. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna start off with this. Um, <clears throat> I could pop pot of desires again just to get the twin twister and just blow him out. But um, yeah, we're not, oh no, he has the max C. Okay, so you're not getting any other draws. I really want a pot of desires. I really do, but I think it's a bad choice. I really do because if um, I just can't pot of desires right now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this in defense mode. We're gonna set this. <clears throat> gonna end our turn, forcing him to have a reckless greed. Um, so if he has it, he has it. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Oh, he does. It was the reckless greed. Okay, so I mean. Uh, there was really nothing we could uh, predict about that, but <clears throat> he still has one more turn after this, so these have to be good. Um, if he draws what's in it, I'm just be I'm be upset. 
I'm gonna just be upset if he draws a two star that he can summon. Um, man, that was that was pretty bad. Uh, fuck, we should have just. Oh man. Oh no, that's good. That's good. Never mind. It's good. Cause now he he has no way to get some more cards. If he does reckless greed again, he's gonna add another another turn where he can't do anything. So. Oh, that's even. That's really good. Uh. So what we can do is definitely special summon this. Uh, we're going to force these back rows out right now. Let's go into this levy here. And this is why I wanted to play Grand Pulse with this too. This is why I played Grand Pulse in the deck that I made with um, this. Because I could just target these back rows. And that's... <clears throat> I, I just hate back rows. So if you guys are like, you know, why the hell do you want to continue? Is this be a faced up zombie? Just one zombie. Okay. Um, sadly, we do have fucking Bone Crusher Banished. He's probably going to Dimensional Barrier. No, it's a breakthrough scale. Okay. Um, <clears throat> well, I can do this. I can do a neat play right now. I can go, I can go Gold Sark, right, for the two star. And we're, we're just going to get rid of some of these back rows. Uh, we're going to get rid of some of these back rows. We're going to Gold Sark for the two star. If it's not banished, no, it isn't. Um, hmm. I can go Dweller right now. I think Dweller might be the better option. Yeah, I'm gonna just go Dweller, so I can just get the max uh, out of this, uh, out of this, uh, what's the name? Out of this burial for different dimension. But yeah, this is why I don't like the Paleo Exilic deck. I really don't think it's, um, it, it's too good, because this, is, this can happen, even though this can happen with a lot of decks where you don't really have the best of hands, but I'm just saying like, oh fuck, damn it. Why nobody told me? God damn it. I messed up. I messed up badly. I messed up really badly. Um, bro, I can't. I could just do this. Hmm. See, I could just go Spectral Sword right now. Oh, uh, you know, I think that might. Uh, I fucked up badly. I'm sitting here talking about how bad this goddamn deck is. Uh, and I done fucked myself over. He probably doesn't have another dimensional. No, he doesn't. Oh, and we have a Revive King. So this is going to be extra good. So if we hit a Rodent Tonin, we're just straight because he would not be able to activate it as long as it's in the graveyard. And I don't think there's any other way for them to get cards out of their graveyard. Um, so what we can do is go this, right? <clears throat> um, sadly, is that he's probably going to have like a Storming Mirror Force or something. And the only back row getting rid of we do have is Coral Dragon. So you know what? I think... That we're gonna just sit. We're gonna just sit and just start popping his back row. Sadly, we don't have a bone crusher, which sucks. Because if we had a bone crusher, we'll be in some, some fairly good business. Um, so we're gonna just target these back rows and try to get rid of them. Um, because even if he does go, uh, even if he does go, uh, see, if I had a storming, I'm definitely not attacking. Um, he he can't really. Even if he does go toad, oh, it was another reckless. Um. Hmm. See, no, I'm. I'm. Ooh, I could. I could. I could desires. But you know, what? I think I'm gonna just. I'm gonna end my turn. I'm in my turn because I'm scared of his back row. He can't draw, like I said, from reckless greed. So it's like, it's not really a problem. It's not. There's no way he can literally get anything on the board. I'm just gonna wait and pop his other back row, and then proceed to attack for game because he can't do anything. Now, I did mess up by not banishing first for Mizuki, but hey, it, it's okay. Uh, we're in a very great position. Unless it's something like Regeki. Uh, yeah, see, it was a dupe rock, so it doesn't really matter. I'm just going to dwell. Oh, wait, no, you know, he can get around it, huh? Okay, so I don't think there's even a reason to dweller. I could just bait out his breakthrough skill, but that just... Um... Yeah, this doesn't this doesn't do anything. Um, just can't get rid of his breakthrough skill. Uh, he's going to use it regardless, so does it matter? Go a spectral sword. Uh, actually, it kind of does matter. So we're going to just use it. <clears throat> Bait out this breakthrough skill. It's not really the uh, best thing to do. Um, like I said, man, this is, I'm, I'm just scared of this. If I wasn't scared of this, I definitely just would have 
ran over everything. But uh, like I said, I, I don't think he's going to be able to mount a comeback. He might actually be able to. Um, don't I have a yeah? I have a solitary banish. So this is this is gonna yeah. I'm just gonna pretty much force him to do the dumb shit. Uh, you can just normal summon this swap frog, send the rodent toad in, um, and then get him a two star out. But I, I, like I said, I don't know what he's going to be able to do. It's not really too much he can do. Facing down this board now, I can go crystal wing and then coral dragon, and then that'd be yep. That they think that's what I'm gonna do. If he does go tree toad, um, just gonna go. I'm just gonna go uh, crystal wing, and then pop it, and then he's gonna. He's gonna negate. Then I could just I could probably go for game after that. Um yeah, I could just just Chief Priest. Um if he does negate with you, yeah, I, I can I can get I, I can beat him. So if he does negate, I could definitely just actually I can't. I can't no actually I can't because this has to be off the field. Um yeah, so Big Apple put itself in a predicament that he pretty much cannot get out of. Um Hopefully, you know, we do get to finish this duel because now it's looking like shit is lagging right now. And I'm about to be very fucking upset after I completely dominated this man. Completely. Hold on. All right. So <clears throat> back real quick. Um, He did make totally awesome. All right. So, yeah, like I said, this game is pretty much over. Oh, that's even better. Um, Now we're starting to fuck up. Now we're starting to fuck up, even though everything was cool. Now it's starting to fuck up because they don't want me to win. They want me to lose. Now I could just twin twister, but that would just obviously be the terrible. This is going to negate. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just not going to twin twister. Come on, Big Apple. Ooh, excuse me if you heard that. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, come on, man. Let's just finish this, man. Let's finish this, dude. There's nothing you can do. Oh, my God. Hold on real quick because this man is taking forever. All right, so dude just quit. The time limit went up. He just, I guess, left. But yeah, man, so we did get the victory. Great, we did not lag out and lose the duel for no apparent reason. But we, hey, we got it. Like I said, um, even if he did do this, get something out. I can just, I was just going to Mizuki, get the two star synchro and the uh, crystal wing. Um, uh, did pretty much bait this, I mean, discard uh, this, actually, because I wouldn't be able to use the two star. Discard and pop this. If he negates, I'll just negate with Crystal Wing. Um, then Levier, get back, um, get back something, or probably get back a uh, solid. I mean, Sage Tribute, Special Seek or something, and then you know, pretty much end up beating him. There's nothing really he can do. So yeah, <clears throat> game one pretty good. Let's get into. All right, and we're going up against Riza, Raza. Uh, 8189 so <clears throat> yeah all right anyways like i usually like to say and this is a very very good hand because we have a bone crusher what a unit zombie um and he's going to set multiple back rows so this is good it's going to be very fantastic but yeah like i would like to say always uh, if you guys do enjoy the content definitely leave a like um also uh let me know what you think about the video by leaving a comment I always hit the ones closest to the deck because those are the ones he, they feel protected by. They feel, you know, it's closest to the deck. So it's like, all right, these are mine. These are good. I'm okay. I always hit the ones closest to the deck because that's what they do. It's just, it's, uh, it, it's, it's, it's like a, it's like a, um, it's a thing that's just in your mind. You know, you want to, it's like, it's like your home, right? On this plan. I, I don't know where I get, came up with that, but yeah, I always hit the ones closest to the deck. Um, let me see. Even if he does like claim exceeds, I mean, I don't, actually, if he does claim exceeds, I don't care. Synchro. I mean, that's what I meant to say. Uh, synchros. What is that? Two dimensional barriers. Oh, a solemn strike and a dimensional barrier. Look at that. Look how good those goddamn cards is. That was ninety dollars I just hit with an eight ten dollar card. Um, but thanks to Bone Crusher, we pretty much can get rid of his whole back row for the cost of nothing. Is he gonna strike me? I'll strike this. This is a good strike. Was he going to max see me? I, I think that's a max in his hand. Actually, it was asking him everything. I don't know what it was. Well, anyways, like I was saying, uh, if you guys do, uh, let me know what you think about the video by leaving a comment. Also, subscribe if you do enjoy the video. Upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1 p.m. on the dot. So you guys get three videos a week. Next week, I will be playing with Gozukis and all that jazz. I'm really excited because I actually, I, when I seen the videos, like I said, of 
Fuck Maxi, man. I really hate fucking Max. I really hate that fucking card. Um, let's see what this. Damn, some dog is getting fucked up out there. Um, but yeah. Uh, uh next week I will be playing with Gold Zuki's. Um, I'll make a deck pretty much centered around that and all that jazz and noise and stuff like that. I really like the card after I've seen those couple of videos, like I told you guys. Um, that. Why would you? Oh, okay. Just, just gonna do this here and just go. Tell you to go, bro. Cause that was, that was stupid. I don't know who told you that was a good idea. R Rise, if you are watching this, oh, that's just beautiful. That's just beautiful. That's just beautiful. You're not getting shit resolved. Nothing of the sort. What was that? A B? I think that was a C. What are we gonna find out right now? It was a B. God damn it. Oh man, if he has a goddamn gadget in his hand, that's gonna be. This is gonna be a problem. Okay, he searches at A. A gets back to B. But I do have a dweller, so I think that might be useful. Um might be very useful actually. Never mind, it's not gonna be useful at all. I hope you activate it again. I really do. I really hope you don't know how to play. No, you didn't activate it again. Alright. So I don't think there's anything I can do besides Oh, Omega. Omega. Oh, that is good. That is really good. So, I can definitely go Crystal Wing. And Crystal Wing pretty much shut him. Yeah, Crystal Wing wins me the duel. Uh, wait, can I go Crystal Wing? I should be able to go Crystal Wing. What was I thinking? Yeah, let me see. I should be able to go Crystal Wing. Right? I don't have a Mizuki in my graveyard, so what the fuck am I th thinking about? Let's get the Bone Crusher out. Um, but yeah, uh, I, I really do, and I really do like um, uh, what is his what is his name? That card that I was just saying, Gozuki. Gozuki is a very, very, very good card. Twin Twister is the best fucking card I could have possibly drawn. That was. It's this this hand was so fucking good. This is so good. I'm just gonna omega this. Um, let's go ahead and get them attacks over. Sadly, we, you know we couldn't get over. Actually, we could have. I don't know why. I, I don't know we couldn't have. Uh, oh, now my omega is not gonna be good. But you know what is gonna be good? Um, going crystal wing with an omega. Um, so, bam, we can go Omega. Actually, oh, we can go Void. That's even better. Void Crystal Wing is 20 times better. I completely forgot that that card exists. And I know what you're thinking. Oh, oh my God, this is Ultra Game. I forgot I had a Spectral Sword. Man, I love Spectral Sword. Sometimes, man, that card be just fucking... It's, it's garbage when you don't got nothing. But this is... This is beautiful. There's there's literally nothing he can do. If he top deck a gadget, oh wait, he can top deck a Thrasher. Thrasher gets over all of this. Yeah, the Thrasher does. Um, I'm just gonna I'm not gonna negate nothing but the hanger unless it's a Regeki. Then I have to negate. Fuck! I had to say Thrasher. I had to fucking say Thrasher, didn't I? I just had to fucking say Thrasher, didn't I? Oh man, Thrasher was the only thing. This is only out. Um, but even that's not an out because you're just gonna lose next turn. Unless he plays Prime. Prime is oh, okay. Actually, no, it's still still game. Still game. Still game. Um let's see what we top deck. Damn, he got the fucking That was a bad choice, I think. Do we play Scrap Dragon? No, we do play Coral Dragon though. Um, so if we top deck, if we top deck a Goblin Zombie, we are in, we are in business. That's even better. Right? Is that better? Wait, I think we can, yeah, we, we win this turn. Um, we can bam, bam. Oh, we can just castell that. I, I don't. I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm sitting there wondering how the fuck I'm gonna get over. I'm like, oh wait, I have a fucking rank four right here. Um, yeah, that's that's game. So, 
that that was um that was a little too hard of a thinking for me and i don't know why but uh yeah um this game is over so i'm just going to continue to talk about my next week's video which is going to be gozuki included and like i said i did very much enjoy i did very much enjoy the uh the replays that um dwayne mcfadden and i forgot who else i don't know if his name is shark Yu Gi Oh pro or whatever the case may be but yeah that's uh their their duels really got me excited for gozuki when i first looked at the card i was like eh. but then uh dwayne mcfadden also left a comment by saying uh, it's pretty much three extra force barrels and it it pretty much is it, it it's a very good card gozuki is very good like you, you can just you can really set your graveyard up because that's not once per turn. Um, hold on, I believe it's not once per turn. Hold on, let me let me get into another duel and let me go check what Gozuki states. Ah, oh, damn it, we're going up against Big Apple again, and he looks like he's going to go scissors, and he went paper once again like he did the first time. But yeah, Gozuki is once per turn, and this hand is actually ass unless I draw a twin twister, and he's opened up Maxi again. What the fuck? Um, all right, so now, now the, the, this is. And then this is why it, it, it could be good. But um, I still don't think the deck is good. I'm going to stick to my uh, what's the name. I'm going to stick to my what's the name. I'm going to stick to it. Um, I don't know why you just didn't get the extra dump. There's no reason not to get the extra dump. Unless you have a different normal summon that you want to do. But you only play frogs. So I don't, I don't understand that whole thing. Okay, there you go. You did do it. Okay. But um, yeah, it looks like we're going to lose this one. Um. We drew an all monster hand. We, we really we can't do shit with this. Now, Ghost Art would be very good. Um, Ghost Art would be extremely good. But this is is over. Swap Frog is, is a good deck. Paleozoic, I think, are not a good deck. Swap Frog makes the deck good. I know, I just contradict myself. But yeah, anyway, like I was talking about, uh, yeah, Gozuki is not, you know what I mean, any time's return. But. Uh, it's it, it's only once per turn, but you know it it's still okay because two two foolish burials in one turn is better than one foolish burial in one turn, and you could possibly have three foolish burials in one turn, which is very good. But yeah, man, I'm very excited to play that deck because um, when it's sent to the graveyard, you can banish the zombie to special summon one from your hand. So if you have a sit, solitaire or something in the grave. You could banish the solitaire, special summon a banished one, and special summon from one from your hand. So that's just oh, that just adds to the play so well. It's just it's a very good it's a very good card. Um, uh, I believe I don't know if we're getting it next set. I hopefully we do. Just like with all the other share new shit. So um, I hope we do get all those cards. Um, gold star, gold star, gold star. This is okay. So um, yeah, I, I, this is just over. This. We, we we can we can beat this deck is just we this is this can't we can't do anything with this we need like a terror top we need a whole bunch of shit uh let me see if he doesn't he's most likely going to get a dupe frog that's that would be the actually you only have one left in your deck yeah you, you have to get the dupe frog that is it's clearly the better answer um you have to get the dupe frog or maybe he's only playing, um, he's not playing Paleo Swords, because we didn't see any, like, he had, like, a good five traps loaded, and Reckless Greed, when he, he had three Reckless Greed, a Wabaku, Dimension Barrier, um, I don't think he had a strike, I think that was the ABC dude, um, yeah, yeah, I think that was, uh, I think that was it, I seen a Wabaku, um, what 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 was the last, I forgot the last what's the name we hit oh dude come on there's literally not a I know we didn't just lose connection but I'm just saying Jesus no oh, no no you didn't Big Apple hold on nope the duel is still going on I don't I don't know what what, what, he, what he did he lose connection um because uh, see like right here the the duel is still going on I don't don't know what what I don't know what he's doing maybe he lost connection maybe I don't know. I didn't lose it on my end because if I press surrender, my shit will surrender, and I'm not doing that. Um, I want to let him lose, but uh, yeah, I don't know, man. It took me about ten minutes to find this goddamn match. Oh, there we go, swap frog. All right, so I'm guessing that he just didn't. Uh, is this shit recording? Yes, it is. Okay, I thought it was not recording because I don't. Okay, now I see him. Now I see him. Um, dude, come on. What the hell? What is the big choice? You taking this long for what? 
See, now I should just special summon this so I can deck him out. But you know, we're not going to be like that, folks. We're not, I mean, not time him out, but we're not going to be like that, folks. We're going to just take this ass whipping on our chin because there's absolutely nothing we can do about this. And he can, oh my God. Well, we're going to see right now if he's paying Paleozoics. But you know, we still have hope. We still do have hope. Even though this looks very bad, we still have hope. But I'm pretty sure um, he does have Dimensional Barrier down. And um, this game is absolutely no way of winning. Um, but we do still have hope. Um, he cannot kill me, as far as I know. He can go to that one that doubles the attack. But I believe that's only once per turn. Uh, unless he can make multiples. Um, but you will not be able to detach the Ronin Totems. So, this would this would be a telltale of what he's playing. Because uh, he sent us... Yeah, he is playing Paleozoics. Okay. So, he just didn't draw any Paleozoics. Why? What? Okay, I don't know what he's playing now. Because he's playing the full Frog Engine. Three Dupe Frogs, three Swap Frogs, and I'm guessing three Ronin Totems. Um... But yeah, this play, this this turn right here would pretty much uh, tell me what he's playing. Now he can go cat shark right here, and then bam, bam, run into him, banish these two special, special, and then go into another tree toad, another tree toad of the Paleozoic card to search a trap. If he is playing Paleozoics, which I'm pretty sure he is, because I don't understand what a generic frog deck would be able to do. I mean, the Paleozoic just adds to it, but I just think the Paleozoic deck is not good at all. I really don't think it is, and I don't even think Totally Awesome is that even good. Um, because it, it, it is it is fairly weak. Um, it's the same problem I would say with Lagia. It's, uh, Lagia, um, when it first, when it first, first, first came out, actually, with Lagia, you had, like, we had triple warning and shit like that, so... It was a lot harder. I think we had double bottomless too. It was like it was a lot harder to get over Lagia because it was 2400 and it negates summons. This doesn't negate summons. It only negates card effects. Now, the, I guess the added bonus of Totally Awesome is that you do get you do get to get the card. You get you do get to set the card if you want it. Um, so yeah, I think this might this might be a generic frog deck. It just really might be a generic frog deck. Um, but yeah, uh, the benefit of totally awesome is you do get to set um, you do get to set the card, so that's good. But I mean, like Infinity, I believe is just the best one of this because Infinity can take shit, so it can only just get bigger and bigger and bigger, and it and it negates. The, ooh, excuse me, and it negates stuff too. So it's like if I don't kill Infinity, he's just gonna get stronger. Told is not going to get any stronger. It's going to stay at the 22. Um, that's pretty much the only thing he's going to get to is 22. Battle phase. Hopefully it attacks with one of these. Oh, no. All right. So we're taking um, 32, 3300. All right. So like I said, man, we could have combated the first tree toad. It's just you can't do nothing when I can't even use Sage. I didn't even know that. I can't even use it. Wow. I i literally just seen that right now. We can, I can't even use Sage. So the whole my whole play was stupid from the beginning. Because my whole thing was I'm a special a normal summon this tribute. He would have to negate. Um then I can gold star. If I drew gold star, I can gold star for chief priest, then he's gonna have to negate. And then I can just do that, bam, and go into a, a, a Scarlight, but he's going triple tree toad. So there's only thing uh, only thing I'm glad about is he can't do anything. Oh, this is just yeah, this this game is over. There's just nothing I can do. There's just nothing I can do. There, this was over from the start. Um, when I drew triple triple uni zombie in the hand, uh, he probably is not gonna negate the one from the hand, because a lot of people don't negate the one from the hand. I mean, you see the one from the deck. That's the one they negate. No, he does. All right, so this is over. Okay, not gonna even not gonna complain. Um, I didn't have the greatest of hands, so you know we're good. He didn't have the greatest hands, so we're one one. I don't know if we're going to face each other again, but I'm going to get one more duel because that was... All right, here we go. So I just went to the checkmate, what's the name? Checkmate server because I, I really like how fast the duels are and shit like that. So we we're going to get uh, the last duel on here. And you see, look at this timer. That shit just jumped down. But uh, no, this is supposed to be TCG only. Isn't it? Oh, no. I'm not playing against... Yeah, I'm not playing against this. I'm, I'll be back. 
I don't understand it. Like when I when I go on when I try to play any deck on Checkmate, they tell me my shit has to be TCG legal. Um, this was actually a very awful hand. Actually, it, it has potential. It does have potential. Um, sadly, we drawn a Totem board. Um, it does have a lot of potential because if we do resolve this, then all of a sudden this hand becomes very very good. Now it just depends on what I'm going to be able to do, but okay. Yeah, that's that. This is happening right now. Yeah, we're we're that's just not gonna happen. Uh, oh shit, probably shouldn't hit the twin twister. Oh no, there's nothing I can do about that. I'm not letting Prince resolve. I done sat there and let Prince resolve about four hundred times. Um, I, that that show didn't fucking end right. No, why would they not let me do that? Ah oh, well, shit. If we lose, we lose. There's nothing we can do. Um. Probably gonna have a what's the name? Uh, he's probably gonna have a what's the name down there. Well, this is the moment of uh, of what's the name? This is the moment of truth. <laughs> if we if he fucking has what's the name, we just lose. Um, you know what? I messed up. I should have let him resolve that prince because he's gonna do dragoons. I could have pretty much shut his whole fucking deck down because after they do the dragoon shit, up, oh, I lost. All right, so we're gonna just let this happen because there's nothing we can do. I should have waited. I shotgunned it because I'm so scared of fucking Prince. But this is not the problem. Megalo is the problem. Megalo is the reason um, he doesn't even respect my back row. Megalo is the reason why this deck can OTK you. And I needed to remember that. But I seen Prince and I thought I was going to be able to draw something good. But this, this game is this over. Uh, but yeah, so this, yeah, this is... Don't don't even do what I did. That was just a fucking bad play. Um, he probably has instant fusion and all that extra shit. Just to be honest with you, oh, he already had the marksman. He might be playing uh, Phoenix Flare X's build. Um, this is yeah, see, that's that's just your opponent. So I might as well just do this now. Hopefully he won't be able to beat me. But yeah, this is when you this is when you do it. You pop pop and then they have shit and they have literally nothing else to do. Oh wait. Diva? Oh okay. Well see look, that that's that's cool. Yeah, this game, this this game is over. Oh, and he has five. Yeah. This, this game is over. Um I completely fucked that game over. Um that was a quick game. Let's get Alright, so let's hope that we're not going up against a goddamn um OCG deck? That's, oh, never mind. We might be going against Monarchs or something. This hand is... What is with these hands all of a sudden? Uh, Well, at least we can get over his board. No, not his board, but if he's playing Monarchs, we can we can disrupt everything. Um, no, he's playing a burn deck. Uh, let's just see. Let's see what he does. Uh, we're going to sit here. Um, um, Yeah, we're going to sit here for a little longer. He's probably going to quit. No, he sets one. In this turn, okay. Well, ooh, that's pretty good actually. Um, let's just normal summon this. See, this is where Kozuki will really come in handy. See, right now I could send. What do you? Oh, fuck! This obliterate. You can target one monster from the field. Send one. Okay. Well, I have to wait. It's card sent to the grave. You can add one. In your graveyard. Okay, well that's that's still gonna happen. I'm still gonna bone crusher the shit out this. So I don't know. Bone crusher is just it's just so good. It's like having a a, a free Lila. And I don't know about y'all, but free Lilas are pretty good. So, I, he's not gonna be able to set shit up. Oh, he didn't even use it. This card is sent from the. Spell trap that you could target one forbidden monster. Add it to your hand. I don't... Oh, never mind. You only oh, you only use one effect per turn. That that's that's okay, I guess. Let's just set both. It that doesn't matter. This is a very terrible duel to end with, but hey, fuck it. I don't... What is this? I've never seen it. See, look, that's that's your problem, Raptor thing. A random Bob Sauce is the head of the curve. That's your problem. That's your fucking problem. He's ahead of the curve, all right? Bone Crusher, I might just I, I might just put this in my deck now. I really like the why am I drawing Totten Town Borg like it's like it's just like it's just fucking I don't know, it's like like at seven in my deck. Jesus Christ. You about to get your shit. 
Threatening war. That is, that's fine. What the hell can I activate in my graveyard? Oh, wow, could have got this back with my idiot ass. I didn't even I think about that. See, this is, yep, I think I might just, I, I'm, I'm going to have to find room for my band Bone Crusher. I think we have to take out Brilliant Fusion. I like Brilliant Fusion, but sometimes it, the card is just it's not good. And that's that's just a simple, that's just a simplicity of it. Uh, I can't even declare an attack, so that would have been stupid to do. Um, but yeah, Bone Crusher, I, I, I really like Bone Crusher. You are ahead of the curve right there, Brandon Bob. So if you are very ahead of the curve. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go get me a Bone Crusher today. That's exactly what the hell I'm going to do. I'm going to go buy one. Hopefully, uh, I think they do have a hollow version. I, yeah, I really like this card. This is, yeah, this is definitely going to make its way in the deck. Positively. Positively making its way in the deck. Um, probably should have used one of the Omegas right there, but it's okay. Probably only has a, excuse me, Exodia card in his hand, so I don't even think it would be that big of a problem. Let's just hold down this A. They fixed the buttons too. Ooh, Mask of Darkness. What are you going to get back? Exodia, so... Let's use one. Ooh, Drowning Mirror Force. That was really good because I would have got my shit blown out. Actually, I wouldn't have. That was that was a bad hit. Ooh, and we hit the Obliterate. Okay, so this game's over. What are you going to do, Raptor fan? You have no extra deck. You can't do anything. All right, so yeah, we're going to just end on that. Yeah, Bone Crusher is very good. Very, very good. To me, if you guys don't enjoy Bone Crusher, I don't know what the hell is your problem is playing with you. But yeah, I really like Bone Crusher. I really enjoy playing with this deck. Sadly, on Wednesday, I didn't really get too many duels because of the internet was messing up. But today, we did get a bunch of duels. Um, yeah, so that was pretty good. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, yeah, that is it for Random Bob Sauce's deck. Um, so next week, we will be playing a Gozuki build. I do not have a deck list for that right now because I have not made it. I will be making it over the weekend, so I can definitely get you guys that video on Monday. So, yeah, definitely look out for the Gozuki vids for next week. Um, yeah, so, yeah, uh, to end this video off good, um, I would like to say thank you to Brandon Bob Shots for sending us the deck list. And it, it's very fun, very, very fun to play. Um, I really like the I really like the uh, Bone Crusher attack. That, that card really like helped me out these whole like this whole three days I've been playing it. It's like <laughs> it's been like it, it's really helped me out. So I mean, there, there's no there's no negative things I have to say about Bone Crusher. I really like it. I'm really about to go pick me up some. Probably gonna buy three of them. They're probably gonna be like 18 cents a piece. So definitely gonna get a couple of those. Um, but yeah. <clears throat> Now, uh, shout outs to you. Thank you very much. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video um, that I did do on your deck. Hopefully, you did enjoy it. So yeah, that is it for today. If you guys did like the video, definitely leave a like. Leave a comment. By, uh, let me know what you think about the deck and the video by leaving a comment. Also, subscribe to the channel if you have not. I upload Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 1 p.m. Uh, so you guys get three videos a week. So yeah, man, three three zombie videos a week. Um, also, click it to help support the channel, which would be very helpful, um, and it, I'd be very appreciative of it. So, yeah, that is it for today. I know it was a fairly long video, but I wanted to get some damn duels before this internet starts starts fucking up. Uh, so, yeah, man, hopefully I do get to resolve this issue today because they are supposed to be coming out. So, man, hopefully today, uh, well, actually, no, the day of recording will be Thursday. So, yeah, hopefully on Thursday they come out and fix it. So it won't be no problems for next week and it won't be no shit is lagging or something like that. So, <clears throat> yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. That is it. Uh, yeah, see you next